Some states shifting policies on masks in schools. The hot button issue has parents divided, including at one school district where a mother is now facing charges for making a threat, saying during a school board meeting that she'd bring loaded guns to her children's school if the district continued to enforce the mask mandate. ABC's Zareen Shaw is here with more. Good morning, Zareen. Good morning, Eva. Schools are becoming a political battleground. In one school, a mom threatening to bring a gun over masks across the country. COVID is a contentious issue. This morning, as some states report turning the corner with the Omicron surge, the debate over masking children at schools is heating up. This school board meeting in Virginia taking a wild turn Thursday as a Page County parent was arrested and released on a $5,000 bond after she was captured on tape threatening to bring guns to her children's school if the district continued to enforce their mask mandate. My children will not come to school on Monday with a mask on. All right, that's not happening. And I will bring every single gun loaded and ready to, I, I will call every. Okay, that's three minutes. She later told police her statement was not intended the way it was perceived. In a statement, the school saying Page County Public Schools does not take these kind of statements lightly and that they are in contact with local law enforcement and the newly minted Virginia governor signing an executive order lifting mask mandates, creating an opt out for schools starting Monday and dividing parents. He will attend on Monday without his mask on. And if they throw him out of school, I'll be in court. Omicron is, I mean, as we've seen, surging like crazy. And I just worry that, that lifting any mask mandate is just too early during a surge. In Florida, the governor's signing a law prohibiting mask mandates for kids, but requiring them for teachers. With cases on the decline in New Jersey, their governor telling a local station he thinks there's a good possibility children can come to school without any masks before the end of the school year. I think there's a real shot of that. We're early days in terms of turning the corner, but it certainly looks like we've begun to turn the corner here, God willing. In the meantime, doctors stress mandatory mask wearing significantly cuts down on COVID spread and that the real pandemic stress for kids is typically over isolation or seeing the financial struggles their parents face with mask wearing far down the list. Children and adolescents may find face masks annoying. They may find them difficult to wear the right way, but they generally take their cues from the adults in their environment. And New York's governor says the school mask mandate there could be ending soon. And here in California, a new proposal would allow kids as young as 12 to get the vaccine without their parents' consent. Officials saying some parents are just getting in their kids' way. Janae. All right, Zareen, thank you so much for that. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.